Hello everyone, Happy New Year! It is 2021 and this is the start of my January catching up with K-pop haul. Um, I have a very exciting first clip. Uh, I got two packages in the mail today, one from MMT and one from K-Town for you. So I'm just going to show you the albums I got. Um, a few of them I will be opening on camera now as they are a little bit um, of an older album. Um, and then a few of them I might push to do um, their own separate video unboxings. Um, but yeah, so without further ado, let's get started. We can do... We'll do MMT first, just because it's um, a smaller box here. Uh, so I already opened it up and I took the bubble wrap off. I feel like it just makes things a little easier. Um, but here is what was inside. Alright, so when you order from MMT, you get these authenticity um, scanner code thingamabobs. Um, but what I ordered from MMT is Ghost Nine's um, newest um, album here. I'm just going to adjust the camera one second. There we go. Um, Ghost Nine's uh, first comeback. This is their second mini album. Um, I ordered this from k -Town. No, sorry. I ordered this from MMT um, to make shipping more worth it because MMT is a little bit expensive. I did order two copies even though I only really need one. Um, but I thought maybe I'd get a better chance of pulling my bias. Um, here are the MMT cards so I can show you those as a sneak peek. Uh, so I got Kangsun and Prince. Um, there is their cards. Super cute. Like I'm so happy. These cards look so good. Um, unfortunately I didn't pull my bias, so I will be putting these up for trade, but um, if you do happen to collect Ghost 9 um, and pulled uh, Jun Hyung, please let me know. Uh, we love. I would love to trade. Um, but yeah, so these I'm going to put into their own unboxing, so I'm just going to put those off to the side and bring in the K-Town For You box. Um, here it is. Open it up. So, from K Town for you, let's pull out the albums here. Let's get rid of this. Um, I got, I think, one, two, three, four, five, five albums here. The first one is Alexa's um, mini album, Decoherence. The other one is Henry's third mini album, Journey. And then I got two copies of Stacy's debut single, So Bad. And another copy of Ghost Nine, um, second mini album. Um, the reason I did this is for the K-Town For You pre-order card, um, which is right here. I did not pull my bias again, but that is okay. That will be up for trade as well, but I will put that all together in its own separate unboxing, but I will open these four albums here on camera. Um, so let's start with Alexa and work our way through it. Um, so there are probably quite a few unboxings already online. So if you want an in-depth unboxing, please look elsewhere. I am just going to do a quick opening, take a look at the photo cards, etc. So this is a slip cover. When you take off the slip cover, you have a bunch of uh, separate thingamabobs. So here is the CD. Um, this is, I have no idea what this is. This looks just like a concept book. Super cute. Goes with the her robot dystopian theme. And then here is the photo book. So I know it comes with three photo cards and everyone gets the same three photo cards, which is amazing. No trading required. Not that I would trade for a uh, solo artist anyway, but yeah. So here is the photo book. 
I absolutely love this album. If you guys are not listening to Alexa, please go out and give her a listen. Her music is so catchy, so bumpin'. Um, highly, highly, highly recommend. Um, but yeah, let's take a look at the photo cards. So for the first one, autofocus maybe. It's okay. That is adorable. Oh my god. You can't tell me this card is not cute. Look how cute it is. The next one. Oh my god. Those claws. I wish I had claws that look like that. That is fierce. Alright, and the last one. I absolutely love these photo cards. Holy... I want to swear. Holy shit. <laughs> so cute. I'm so happy I purchased this album. Um, I can't wait to see what she has next coming in 2021. This was the end of her um, concept or the storyline type of thing. So I'm super excited for new stuff coming in 2021. Alexa is so good. Give her a listen, y'all. Um, but yeah, so that was Alexa. I'm going to put it to the side. And now we're going to open up uh, Henry's mini album here. Um, for those who do not know, um, Henry is from Toronto, which is where I'm from. So it's super cool to um, have a K-pop artist from your hometown. Um, I previously was supporting him when he was in Super Junior and for his solo stuff when he was in SM Entertainment. So when he went off on his own, I was like yearning for something new. I was hoping he would make more music and here it is. Um, so the front and the back. Please go give this album a listen. Henry is so talented. Uh, he's so funny. I'm sure you've seen him on variety shows and whatnot, but yeah. Go and do that. Let me go ahead and take out the photo card and other inclusions. Make sure there's nothing else in here. All right, so I'm not going to be doing an in-depth flip through, of course, because this album's a little bit older now. But here he is. He is so adorable, so cute, so talented. I love this, like, the styling of this album. So cute. Alright, so that was um, his third mini album there. Let's take a look at what comes inside. So the first thing you get are these stamp looking stickers. So that's super cute. And then you get a handwritten uh, message. This is all in English, so I could read it to you guys, or you can pause the frame or pause the video and read it yourself. Yeah, there is the postcard. Oh my god, he is shirtless. Sir, put a shirt on or don't. I don't mind. Um, but yeah, here is the photo card. I don't know how many photo cards come in the album. Um, I won't be trading or buying the other ones. I'll just keep what I pull, but let's take a look. Very cute. It will look nice on my soloist page. I don't have too many soloists um, that I collect, but he's going to look super cute on there. But yeah, so that is Henry's third mini album. Go check that out as well. You will not be disappointed. And for the last unboxing I'll be doing for this clip um, will be Stacy's debut single, So Bad. There are so many unboxings already on YouTube, so go check those out. Um, but if you want to see who I pull, um, let's take a look. Take it. Right, so back in front, it only comes with two songs as it is a single, um, but that is okay. There is a lot of stuff in here, oh my gosh. All right, let's take the inclusions out. Alright, so here is the album underneath the dust jacket. I won't be doing a in-depth flip through, flip through, but here is a sample of 
the pictures you get in the photo book. Very, very cute. Alright, sorry I got a little distracted there, but I'm going to quickly open up the second one here as well. Alright, so let's swap the poles for over there. So inside the album you get some stickers. And a postcard here. Is it the same postcard? Yes, so just the one postcard there. And then you get this fragrance. Ooh, it smells real good. This is like a like a fragrance scented paper. I don't know what you want to call it. Mmm, but that is a lovely smell. Alright, and then you get a little film strip here. Are they the same? They are. But let's see what we're all here for. All right, let's take a look. So the first photo card is, <gasps> shut up, shut up. Did I just pull Suman's photo card? Oh my God, okay. So uh, my two biases are Suman and Jay. Um, so that's who I'll be collecting for Stacy. Um, but I'm so excited I pulled Suman's photo card, yes. Okay, Whew. good luck so far, good luck. All right, let's take a look at the second one. Okay, okay, so this is Seyun. Super cute. Oh, she's so pretty. Okay. The next photo card belongs to... Okay, this is Isa. Oh my gosh, they are all so pretty. Damn. Let me put you there. And the last photo card is Shion. So pretty. Okay. So I will have some trading to do, but that is okay. I love the variety. I didn't pull a dupe album this time, so that's super exciting. And I did get a Suman photo card, so yay to me. Um Yay. Um, so yeah, that is the end of what I want to show you guys. Um, stay tuned for the unboxing. Actually, the unboxing for Ghost 9 will be up before you see this video. So if you want to see my Ghost 9 polls, go check out that video. Um, but yeah, I'll see you guys in the next clip. Hello everyone, welcome to another clip in my January K-pop haul. Um, so today I have a very special clip. Um, I am showing you guys what Maria got me for Christmas this year. Um, so yeah, let's just jump right into it. So here is the card. I believe she said she got this off Etsy. It is a Monster X light stick and it has like these little beads in there. So it's super cute. Um, inside is a letter and some stickers. So that was super cute. Um, but for the album that she bought me is MCND's first, second, no, first mini album, um, Earth Age. So I guess the other one was a single album, Ice Age. Yeah, but yeah, so I'm not going to do a super unboxing. I'll just show you what comes inside. All right, so it's a nice box, comes with the CD. There are two versions to this. Maria got me the blue one, because blue is my favorite color. Comes with stickers, and the photo book. All right, so it also comes with a ID photo card, which is the win photo card I got. So you can use it as like a bookmark as well. 
Um, and then for the photo card, I pulled my bias. So I got thick. Super happy about that. So yeah, this was a super awesome Christmas gift. I also got this um, BTS uh, Taehyung. Like, I guess it's the freebie card. Super cute. I love it. Um, but yeah, that is the Christmas gift that I got from Maria this year. Um, stay tuned. There'll be more clips in this video. Um, so I'll see you there. Hello, welcome to another clip in my January haul. So today is very exciting because I have um, finally received my concert goods for Dreamcatcher's Seven Spirits concert that they did this past November. Um, so I purchased this back when the concert was announced. Um, before I knew I was going to be away due to medical reasons, but I was still able to watch the concert um, and my goods finally showed up two months later. So um, let me show you what came with um, the concert goods. So I purchased the VVIP bundle, which was I think $99 um, and it came with this came with this hat here. So it's a simple black hat. It has the concert name stitched in has a Dreamcatcher logo inside. So super cute, I love anything black, so that's super nice. Um, and it also came with this sweater. So on the front of the sweater, it's a hoodie. Um, on the front of the sweater, it has um, their logo. And on the back of the sweater, whoa, hit the tripod there. All right, on the back of the sweater, it does have the concert information. So, Dystopia, Seven Spirits, um, November 7th, 2020 at 2200 o'clock. So yeah, I watched the concert and it was so good. These girls are so talented. I can't wait to see what 2021 has in store for them. Um, and I will continue to be supporting them. Um, but yeah, so that is the hat and the sweater. Uh, but it also comes with other goods as well. So I'm going to open this one up and show you what it is. Alright, so inside here, this is the lenticular photo card set. So we open it up. And we open it up again. And again. So it comes with a photo card per each member. Um, and it's a lenticular. So one side of the lenticular is their concert outfit. The second side is their Halloween con uh, outfit. So we have Jiyu there, and Suwa, and Shiyun, and Hendong, and Yuhyun, and Dami, and Gahyun. So I think this is super adorable. I'm usually shitting on lenticulars for how bad quality they are, but these ones are actually really good quality. Like, they're both two clear images, um, and that is what lenticular should be. I should not be able to see the other image um, that prominently as I'm flipping through it. But yeah, so very well made. No complaints here. This has redeemed lenticulars for me. <laughs> but yeah, so that is the lenticular set. Um, but then you also get a photo card set. Okay. So before the photo cards, um, you get a online, or not online, you get a concert ticket. Um, if it would focus. There we go. So you get the concert ticket. Um, this is in place of an actual ticket that you would have got if the concert was in person. So I really like this. All the information is on the back and it has like a little fake gate one, row one, seat one. I think that's super cute. But yeah, so you get a ticket um, and then the photo card set. All right, we can go through this together.
All right, so that is, let me just adjust my camera. Um, that is everything that you got in the concert bundle. Um, I really enjoyed the concert. If you haven't listened to Dreamcatcher, please do so because they are so talented. Um, 2021 is going to be an exciting year for them. Uh, so I'm super excited to um, see what happens next. Um, there will probably be one or two more clips left in this video. Um, so stay tuned. I'll see you then. Hello, welcome back to another clip in my January haul. Uh, this will be the last clip in part one. So I have a couple of pieces of mail to open for you today. Um, I've already opened them and sent proof pictures to the traders that I traded with. Um, but yeah, I'm going to open them on camera um, and then complete my January haul, at least for the first half of the month. Um, so yes, yeah, super exciting. Let's go ahead and do that. So the first one here. This one's very exciting. Alright, this one I've been waiting for a long time, actually. Um, this came from somewhere in Europe. I don't want to say where, uh, but it came from a country in Europe and it took like two months to get to me, which was very, very sad. I thought it was lost in the mail, especially with the holidays and whatnot, um, but it finally arrived. So that I'm super grateful for. Um, we can go ahead and read the note together and it says, thank you so much for trading with me. I hope Chalia gets to you safely, please. Um, hold on, I'm so blind. Uh, please say once they do. Uh, there is the handle there. Um, but yes, I am finally so happy to have this in my collection. This is the last unit card I needed for uh, Not Shy, so I'm glad it arrived. And here it is. Yay. Alright, so the next piece of mail has the address on the back of it, so I'll just take that off camera. Um, but here is the card, and we open it up. This is another one <laughs> that also took way over a month to arrive, but it has arrived, so I will not complain. Um, so it says, thank you so much for trading with me. I hope Lido gets there safely. Have a great day and keep supporting one us. There is the handle, if you can see that. So this is Lido's uh, regular album photo card. There was two for this album. Uh, this is the other one. So super happy to have that in my collection. Um, that will complete his album photo cards, even though they just announced their full length album coming soon. So more cards to collect. Um, but we'll go ahead with the next piece of mail. All right, so this one came wrapped in this blue paper and it says, thank you for buying there is the handle there uh, so this one I think there's three cards in here two cards something like that um, but this one helps my Evergo collection very much so here is Mia Yiren and Iyu uh, so these two are for my OT6 set which I think is now complete so that's exciting. And this one is also for an OT6 set, but the hollows. So super happy to have all three of these. Um, the seller was really nice and these were not too crazy priced. So super happy to be working my way through Everglow. That's very exciting. The next piece of mail also has the address on the back. So I will just take that off camera. Uh, here is the photo card, oh, sorry, the envelope, not the envelope, the letter. Um, Season's greetings, as you can see. Um, it says, hey, uh, thanks for trading with me. Hope soon gets to you safe and sound. Have a wonderful 2020 and beyond. Stay safe and healthy. As you can see, we're in 2021 now, but I did get this um, like last week, so it was probably just caught up in the holiday rush. But it is here. And it is stubborn, it does not want to come out. There we go. All 
Okay, so here she is. This is Suyun from Wikimiki. This is the OT8 set I wanted to collect. Um, so yeah, slowly working on my OT sets. So this is very, very exciting to have in my collection now. Um, and we'll move on to the last letter of the week. And there is a lot, but we will go ahead with the note. It says, thank you so much for trading slash buying from me. Please let me know when these arrive and please reuse the card if you can. Stay safe. So this is Carolyn. You all know her from YouTube. Um, there's her Instagram and Twitter as well. Um, but yeah, I purchased some cards from her um, recently, sort of, back in December. <laughs> And they have finally arrived, so let's go ahead and open these. Alright, so here is the freebie that she included. That has her information on the back. So that's super cute. Um, but as for the cards that I purchased, I purchased this Young J. This is an OT7 set I wanted to complete. So I bought Young J from her. And then I bought these two Wano PCs. I think I'm almost complete now, which is super exciting because I know his comeback is coming soon. So super happy to have those. Um, but yeah, that is it for this week's mail. Um, and this is it for part one of my January haul. So thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in my next one. Bye-bye.